Hello everyone and welcome back guys to a brand new video and today we are here on F1 2012 for this Grand Prix Last of First Challenge because as some of you do remember the 2012 Grand Prix I think is safe to say one to remember and today we are going to be driving as Sebastian Vettel trying to win the world title now unfortunately for Sebastian you can't overcome Lewis Hamilton unfortunately for him so Lewis Hamilton you know in my opinion definitely the deserved world champ here I know people may disagree with that but hey how I don't I'm not really too bothered but yeah so today we are going to be doing a 25% race around the Brazilian Grand Prix circuit starting from the very back as Sebastian Vettel so if I'm not mistaken to win the Formula 1 world championship then we need to finish P5 or you know Alonso if Alonso finishes lower than P3 we're guaranteed to win the world title here today. But yeah, hopefully we can try and get it into the points during this Grand Prix. 24 cars on the grid though, it's gonna be interesting obviously. With a few more vehicles on the road to try and navigate. But we, we shall wait to see, the V8 does sound quite good. No formation laps on this game though, too old for that. Got the McLaren front row lock out there, just goes to show how good Lewis Hamilton jets are button really hot weather. In P3, no idea where Nando is then, that's probably not ideal for him. For the championship finale, but here we are then, on the grid, ready for this Brazilian Grand Prix. It's three lights, it's four lights, it's five lights. And it's lights out, and away we go, I'm going to try and use a tiny bit of the curls off the start. They're going to hopefully jump all these back marker curls very, very quickly on the run, up to turn one. Just about to find my way through, Ricardo, then. oh my god, it's a car park. That's Fernando Alonso out, basically. That That's carnage is what's happened there. There's cars all over the shop, I think. Well, we made up 11 positions there. Fernando Alonso was already out of the Grand Prix. <laughs> that's not the ideal way we want to start this. I think we'll, we'll give Fernando a second chance. I don't think Sebastian would in the real Grand Prix, but, you know, that was an absolute pile up at turn one. There were cars all over the shop. That's my light. And it's a light show. And the way we go, I'm just cool. Five laps worth of spare fuel. I'm running 23 lead. 23 laps on an 18 lap race. Ah! Try and find my way to the inside. That I think. Oh, I've been punted up the rear. And there's a Felipe Massa nearly taking me out there. There's Bruno Senna, the man, the myth, the legend. Even though Sebastian did really turn him in, in the real Grand Prix, but we'll, we'll boss over that. Hulkenberg being terrible as usual. Down the inside of Senna, we need to make contact where they. What is up with the AI and their brake checking? This is ridiculous. They don't even do it this much in my career mode. Ah, oh, come on. Move. Oh, the center down the inside. Oh my god, I just forgot to carry on turning in there. Oopsie daisy. We made up nine positions though in the first half lap of the Grand Prix. Oh, the AI have held each other up once more. This is good for me. Oh, from very, very far back there, but Nico Hulkenberg. Move out of the way. We are a man on a mission. This rev limiter is probably going to cost me, but hey ho. I'm doing far better in the middle sector than the AI around me, and that's sort of a bit more important, I feel, at the moment. Got to play for the breath and strength as we go through this lovely, lovely right And Oh my, the AI breaks so early into that. But we're past on our phone. Kimi Raikkonen, P11. It, it always surprised me how well Kimi Raikkonen did. Like, because that Lotus card, don't get me wrong, it wasn't exactly slow. It was sort of just consistently good. He came P3 over in 2012, which that was his first season on return. And I think, fair play to him, that's actually a pretty good result. I don't rate Kimi that much, I won't lie. Uh, he's a good driver and all, but his World Championship was a bit lucky. That mean you could use all of the pit lane, rather than all this safe stuff now. 
ahead in the next five laps. Raikkonen right, getting mugged though by the man, the myth, the legend, the Sergio Perez. Oh, we got much the better run for there. One second of the car behind. He will He's in the DRS. DRS. Bye bye, Raikkonen. And I'm on the road with Oh my god, the rest are in Perez going slowly. Triple overtake. Yes, can't turn in, turn in. Oh, still side by side with the rest are. Oh, there we are. Triple overtake. Now we're up into the points in this 4 on 3. I think slowly but surely we are closing in on Fernando Alonso in this race. I think pit stop wise, yeah, it should be about lap 8. It's on the end of this lap. Let's see if a lot of the AI do or not. Uh, on doesn't. Not, well, a few cars have. Flying in at 200 miles an hour. Uh, hopefully we don't get held up. Ah, and we've been held up. Lovely! 4.5 seconds, just what I always wanted. And we've lost out quite a bit of time. Be careful not to drive over the white line when coming out of the pit, or you'll get a penalty. Let's get out of the pit lane now. But Kobayashi is still just ahead of me. You have no more scheduled pit stops, so look after your time. quite a big train of cars there. We could potentially gain a bit of time. Lost a bit of time, I feel, for Roman Grosjean ahead of me. Not ideal, but hopefully the AI can fight each other a bit. Yeah, look at that, three seconds now. So, yeah, about that two seconds we lost in the pit lane. And now the fact we can't drive in a straight line around this circuit. Not ideal, but potentially we can really sort of bring up the pace a bit. P6 is still a potential here, and I don't think... I don't think Fernando Alonso is winning this Grand Prix. I think the McLarens are, are still leading. Got another car out of this Grand Prix though. It's Nico Rosberg. What's happened there? No, it's not. It's Timo Wolf. What? Why is Rosberg suddenly down? Oh, I don't know then. Rosberg's been overtaken then. I've got a replay. Please have got a rewind. Please. Oh no! Oh no! Oh well, there we are then. That's basically the end. Uh, how do I change the camera? Just dip a wheel on the outside into the corner. Already the over rotation is too much. As you can see, as we come out on the exit, I cannot do replay cameras to save my life. But yeah, we completely wipe out Kimi Raikkonen. One of the Sauber's gets through. There's a Force India. Kimi Raikkonen did end up getting lost around this circuit. I've got a time penalty. Nearly got another one there because we wiped out Nico Hulkenberg. I'm losing positions left, right, and centre. Hulkenberg, what's happened there? I've got. Is that a legal overtake? I don't think so. Brilliant overtake now. Push. Brilliant overtake now. Push. I've turned back up two places. Oh, nice bottle at turn one. Looks like the DRS isn't Sorry. Working. The guys are looking into a fix. Oh, that's... This race has gone downhill right at the very end. No, Vitaly Petrov. Oh my god, I get being my kid. Let's give all the Brazilian fans what they want. And the AI has been lovely. <laughs> oh, not a good race. P21 in the end, that's probably not. Well, that's unless Fernando does alright, I think, to be honest though. Sebastian did win more races throughout the season. So if he came third, we tied. He came third, we tied! Yay! That's good then. So Fernando Alonso finished the season with 275 points. And we finished the title 
with... Oh no, I've done my maths wrong. I've, I've done my maths horribly wrong. Oh no, well, Fernando Alonso's in you. He finished on 275 points. We finished on 273 my teammate Maldonado was at a time my, my sorry, my teammate Mark Webber was actually fighting with Maldonado at the end there. Lewis Hamilton wins the Grand Prix though. That was not the way I intended to finish this season, to be honest. I wasn't honestly expecting that Yeah, well, there we are then. Sebastian Vettel, you are no longer a four time world champion. We somehow got twenty seconds worth of penalties in the end. But hopefully you know you guys have enjoyed this video. It sort of went pear shaped towards the end, but yeah. I will see you guys next time for a brand new video.